Sheriff's life just became even better for nearly 100 people living in the Show Me State. Yeah, this afternoon, a ceremony was held at Missouri State to naturalize 84 applicants as U.S. citizens. Those folks come from 31 different countries. And our Bria Douglas spoke to two of the new U.S. citizens. Bria, what can you tell us about them? David and Heather, one is a woman from Mexico who has worked for 10 years to become a citizen, and the other one is a man from the Ukraine. He's waited for five years to become a citizen. Both tell me that today's naturalization ceremony is exhilarating. Exciting. I'm so happy. Like. It's a dream. One glance into MSU's Plaster Student Union Theater and you might mistake it for the United Nations as each person from their country stood to be recognized. China. <laughs> El Salvador. 84 people from 31 countries gathered with one pursuit to achieve the American dream. Today we celebrate making our country stronger and we make it stronger by welcoming people of talent energy landis arzoco is one of those people originally from mexico she's waited 10 years to become a u.s citizen she wanted to live in america to escape her country's poor leadership mexican government is not really good so the people who live in mexico uh, really want something different like America. Orzoko says President Trump's position on immigration and illegal immigrants doesn't bother her. I think what he wants is to have legal people. Ukraine is where Michaelo Bondarico is from. He came to the United States as an exchange student and wanted to make America his new home. It's taken five years for him to become a citizen and he's hoping it comes with monetary freedom. Financial opportunity is much better than in Ukraine and if you hard worker, if you're doing your job, you can achieve anything here. I want to study, I want to go to the college. After the ceremony, the new U.S. citizens were able to sign up for a passport, social security, and register to vote.